Thank Hi. you, mate. Oh, look at that. Help on board. That's the heavy one. You can do anything today, come is that, you know? Yeah, I loaded the whole thing up. What do you mean, am I doing anything today? <laughs> I'll get, oh, yeah, let, let me look like I'm doing something. Thank you very much. We're in a new studio today. We are at Big Sky Studios. Lovely stuff. Right. Yeah, stick me in the tiny little lift. What Two. floor am I going to? Oh, I can, I can see the floor from here. Uh, number five. Number five. Ah, oh, I like this photo. <laughs> Are you warming up my dinner again? Yeah. Oh, wow. Decent. Look at this little DJ booth. I like it, Wellesie. This is like the nicest studio I've seen. No offense to your one. It, it, it is nicer than my one, I can say that. This one's got, look at the makeup table here. This is massive, got a big chilling area, big table. Well, we're gonna put this on the cove. I don't want to walk on the white cove in case I get it dirty, because I've just been out in the rain. And you're looking at me like, uh-oh, is that what I'm doing right now? And yes, I am judging you hard. How am I meant to set the tripods up without being on the cove? Good point. <laughs> <laughs> this is basically what we do every shoot. I personally own three of these Blackmagic cameras and I pack them in a bag like this. So camera goes on top and then it already comes with a tripod plate. So it makes it easy to hand off, here you go mate, and just clip to the tripod straight away, straight out the bag. There you go, see, done. Also, I like to use monitors on top of them. So what I do, I attach a monitor on top and that's also ready to go, there you go. And that gets repeated <laughs> uh, for as many times as we need the cameras. So today, we need five cameras, and I will explain why. So, five cameras, you ask. Why five cameras? We have three groups of two. So, there's gonna be each of the boys coming up and trying their food individually. Now, because I don't know how they're gonna react to the food, I thought each person should have their own dedicated camera. I also thought that to cover the whole lot and show you the audience a perspective of like what's going on, there should be a wide shot. So that's bringing us up to four cameras. And also, I thought, how could you not have a camera that focuses on really close up details. So that's where our fifth camera comes in and we're gonna put that on a 70 to 200 mil lens, meaning it can zoom in a lot. And that's gonna help us get all the nice close up shots, all the food they're tasting, and also any expressions that they're gonna give to have them in super close up. Once we've set those cameras up, we're gonna try to drag this table in there and just get rid of some chairs. You know what, I can, I can hear, I can hear speaker noise. Does, does this mean we can put music on? Can we go in here? Am I allowed here? What's that? That's a CD player. You might have to call the man. Is there Spotify? There you go. Oh, look, somebody's been watching, somebody's been watching <laughs> Sidemen. <laughs> well, look mate, at this. Mate, that's not even staged. People that's, are gonna think that's staged. That's not even staged. No, that's not staged. If it was staged, it would be my diss track on there. <laughs> which is what I actually wanted to play. But you know what, fair play. They've already got Sidemen loaded up on here. Mate, I reckon it's because someone saw a booking for Sidemen and they were just like, who are these guys? You know what? Let's, let's go for it, let's go for it. We need some good entertainment whilst we're uh, setting up. So here we go, click play. This was a good time. This was pre-COVID times. Let's go. Tie the gift. <laughs> you guys something else I really love doing. So this is a V-lock battery. The back sort of explains why it's a V. It's in like a V type of shape. These last on the Blackmagic camera for hours. So when I first got these, I had troubles actually mounting these onto something. I was like, do I need to set up my camera to make my camera big and beefy and set it up onto like a camera cage? No, I found this useful little accessory which is a mounting plate and on the back over here, this little system, you can unscrew this and clamp it between whatever you like. I also have a smaller version of that, which is this little accessory and I absolutely love it. So as you can see, it clamps around something like a tripod leg. So something like this, it clamps on to the leg of a tripod. And now what I can do, get the battery and clamp it. 
easy. And then when I want to take it off, there's a button on here, boom, slide it up. And that way I don't have to rig up the Blackmagic camera. So I can literally leave it as minimal as possible. Because sometimes I don't really like rigging it out with the cage and all of that stuff. Your camera just gets unnecessarily bulky. I just don't like carrying the extra weight either, especially when I've got so much to carry already. I wanna try and be as portable as possible. There we go, lovely. So they're gonna be trying out food individually here. So maybe space it out a bit more, lovely. Now I want each camera, one, two, three, to focus on a shot of each individual on the 24 to 70 mil lens. So let's set that up. Oh, I was actually gonna come and hug you as well. Oh. I was gonna be like, put my hand around you and be like, hey, hey Toby, how's it going? It's going all right, mate. It's going all right. You know what I love about Sideman Sundays? What? Is that you guys individually get to do them. I have and and it, you know what? It means every week I get to like have a friend. A different friend. A different friend every, every week. I do a lot of mine without you though. I know, it upsets me. We should do more videos together. We did hot ones, hot ones were sick. Hot ones were sick. A lot of people say, like, because they saw Harry in my previous one, mm -hmm. they're like, oh, Harry's so professional. He well, like, he now gets the job done. Now they get to see you be professional. Look at that. Listen, I'm on the laptop. Not everyday gaming headset. Not like... everyday gaming headset, but everyday <laughs> Sideman hoodie, Sideman Jeez, Cobra, Cobra, okay. Cobra, sorry, Cobra. <laughs> what was the challenges for this video? The challenges, getting the guys to reply about what they wanted to do and what they didn't want to do. It was very last minute. This is a last minute shoot that was dumped on me because no one else wanted to take it. Because the weather was bad, we had to take a shoot that we were gonna do outside. We had to bring it inside, but that shoot you can't do inside. And I feel like over the winter, we're gonna be doing that a lot. A lot of indoor shoots for sure. Bend Why over. does she look like she's about to? Whoa. You say bend over, I knew it. Who's bend over? You know I, don't, bend? I don't know a Ben Dover. These are really good for as much on here. Go on. Stop, I hate, <laughs> I hate those sounds. What else are you gonna do with that rubber glove? <laughs> yeah? <laughs> NordVPN is a service that encrypts your internet traffic and protects your identity. And because Nord has sponsored today's video, every purchase of a two-year plan will get you one additional month free and a surprise gift. You'll randomly be gifted one, 12, even 24 months of service on top. So make sure to use my coupon code CONSTANTINE at checkout. Even if you have nothing to hide, you probably don't like the idea of being watched and tracked. And with many of us now working from home, especially those who are working with sensitive data, privacy and general security could be the main reasons why you would choose a VPN service. Even when browsing the web in the comfort of your own home, using a VPN is a pretty good idea if you're not comfortable with targeted ads. Platforms like Netflix are extremely limited outside of the US. A VPN service allows you to connect to hundreds of remote servers in different locations, this way bypassing censorship. I've installed the Nord extension for Chrome browser and now with one click, I'm able to change my location. Netflix now thinks that I'm located in the US. As a result, I'm able to find and play thousands of additional movies and TV shows that aren't normally available to me in the UK. And with a 30 day money back guarantee, you can't go wrong, especially with a special cyber deal that I'm able to offer. Every purchase of a two year plan will get you one additional month free and a surprise gift. So make sure you check out the link in the description and use my coupon code CONSTANTINE at checkout. The challenges, the guy's not replying, something I'm very used to getting aired. Same. Okay, <laughs> I'm glad I'm not the one. You're not the only one. Okay, okay, okay. Yeah, organizing food, finding expensive and oh, expensive enough food to do. Getting a freaking microwave, because we wanted a kitchen, remember? Yeah, yeah. We, we couldn't we... get a place with a kitchen. Like a lot of the studios in London are booked up right now. So I've had to buy a microwave and bring it down myself. So if you need a new microwave, there's, there's one available after the shoot. I know who's taking that microwave. I'm not saying any names. That's John, isn't it? <laughs> I'm not saying any you names. You need a microwave, mate. I get it. Do you need a microwave? I'll take a microwave. <laughs> Wait, yeah, I need to get that. Wait, there's a free microwave going, are you kidding? <laughs> Wait, not yet. We need to use it. Mate, a DeLonghi, do you know, do you know what brand yeah, this is? Do you know what this is? Bro, <laughs> this is sick. Chin Thanks, Chan. Toby. Chin Chan for the microwave. <laughs> Oh, George, this George. is how we're gonna. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. The thing is, I didn't even want it. <laughs> Toby, you're in it as well. <laughs> okay. Rock, Rock paper, paper, scissors, shoot. You're all dead. Oh Why no. Oh, I'm out, I'm out, I'm out. I'm out. I'm out. Two people. I only got killed by one person and I killed both of you. So Ooh. I win. Okay. I'm not sure what the rules are. Yeah, I'm yeah. not gonna lie. I think he's gotta go again. Look, how many kills did you get? I, I got knocked out by two people. Yeah, but how many kills did you get? You got one kill. How about this? He's definitely dead. I got, got one, one, kill. One, kill. one kill. You got one kill. Yeah, he got one you got kill. one kill. I got two kills. So I win. It's my microwave! Yeah, yeah. <laughs> 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 I'm going to 
to take it down. All right, so cameras have been set up. Let me show you what we're working with. It's super bright. We can set up a light over here and we set up two lights there as like sort of our edge light. We've got camera number one, focusing on person number one, middle guy. We've got a camera over here for the middle person. We've got a camera over here as our wide shot. And then for our third person here on the edge, the cameras that are focusing on the mid shots of each individual person, they are all being filmed on the Canon 24 to 105 mil lens. And I've set it to about 70 mil. Um, uh, length distance but also the reason that this camera is on top of this one is because these are much lower and they're getting individual people whereas this one gets the whole table in shot and I like like a little high angle on it so once all the dishes are on there you'll be able to see them on this camera and then we're waiting for one more camera to turn up and that will be hooked onto this bad boy lens. This is the 70 to 200 mil lens, which means we can zoom in. What we, what's breakfast saying? Did you guys get breakfast? No, no. no. I don't sort out breakfast. Each to. man to their own. Ah, oh, look at this boys. Nice. What are you guys getting? I'm gonna go to a cafe actually. You know what John, I, I heard there's an Iceland nearby. Maybe you can get some food and you got a microwave here now, so probably a good shout. I, I'd say go feed yourselves. Well, I would. I've asked them like three times. You come, Jay? I know, there's Tesco's as well. Let's go. Oh, let's go. You're going to Tesco's? Yeah, Tesco's first. Alright, what's my meal deal saying? Mine's not really a meal deal. Mine's just smoked ham and egg free ranged sub roll. And then I never feel like they put enough ham in there. So I add some of my own extra ham in there. And then top it off with a healthy water. And when I'm low on energy, we've got one of these. <laughs> I wanted to have this last night because I was up editing late, um, but I actually didn't end up opening it. I'm just full of energy today. This card actually has nothing on it. It's a complete prop. Just in case you were wondering, what are we reading from here? Nothing, it's empty. All right, cameras are rolling. Action. How is it going, guys? And welcome to Simon Cheap but Expensive Food Challenge. Well, hey. You guys want the next one? You know what? Boys didn't finish the whole drink. I've actually had never had this, so... No, no, he, he didn't drink out of this one. He drank out of the cheap one. Oh. Yeah, he said, give me the cheap one. What do you know about drinking Dumpy out of one of these knives, mate? <laughs> I don't. Yeah. There you go. In case they think all bougie and shit, uh, let them know we still keep it classy. But just from the end. Right, yeah. cheers. Good shoot, yeah. good shoot. Yeah. <laughs> I don't know, I'm not an alcohol expert. Yes, alright. But, previous Cyber shoot, we had champagne. Now we're having champagne again. There's a reoccurring theme. Josh, I want champagne on the next shoot as well. It really motivates team spirit. Look how happy. Yeah, you have to work sober. That's the part of the rule. I know, but I, at the end. I oh, know, you can, yeah, you want, you want champagne. We can, get free, we can get free 99 Chardonnay all the time. No, no, nice. I, want, I want the 500 pound one. No, 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 3 pound 99 Chardonnay, it's good. We could decide. Yeah. 3 pound 99 is good. You, you like bargains anyway, you like discounts. Come on. I do, I do. Proper bargain, proper nice. Exactly. Yeah, this one, this one's like, it's peas, but is it yeah. worth? 12 pound, 12, 13 no. pound. No, 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 this, this one's peas. That's not the expensive. It is. Oh, yeah, that is. Wait, is that the wine? Yeah, this is, this yeah, is the cheap that's, that's one. Oh, okay, 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 yeah, yeah. Hmm. I'll stick to uh, Coke. Okay. I mean... <laughs> oh! <laughs> no, 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 this one, this one. So yeah, it's the end of the shoot and I'm just getting some last minute cinematics of the foods in case that needs to be cut into the edit. In case the audience wants to see the food up close. So there you go, we've got our chocolate, got our camera. I'm literally just gonna hit record on that and this is the expensive chocolate so I'm just saying it's the expensive chocolate into Mike so the editor knows and there we go thank you and now we get a cut away of cheap chocolate this is the cheap chocolate you know what perks of the job I think that was the expensive chocolate okay ready no Oh, it's, mmm, mmm. <laughs> How about the cheap one? Hey, Colin, you got that chocolate that was saving for everyone, eh? Yeah. I see how it is. 
Um, there's some left. Uh, it's a cheap one though. Alright. <laughs> it actually tastes nice. It tastes as equally nice. Mate, it's chocolate. How can it taste bad? Um, Harry, <laughs> strap that on safe, lad. You're gonna need it. Uh, Alright. Mate, I, I didn't drink that much. I'm fine. I'm fine. I'm recovering. Yeah, yeah, you didn't drink right, that much. Also, yeah. Fuck you. Because <laughs> oh, you're my boy. You're just my boy. I, yeah, and I, I niced you. With what? Like £100 worth of champagne. If I die, that on, glass. The way, if I die on the way home, you know it's on you. Know it's on you. <laughs> no, like, no, 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 no. Because your dies in cycling. What? Because it's because of you. <laughs> no, no. Alright, maybe text me when you get home, please. I'm thinking, right. Can I just book you an Uber? I'm, I'm doing my cycle. No, I'll book your cab. I'll book your cab. Text me when you get home. <laughs> 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 look after him, please. Oh, no, no, no. <laughs>